perfect lasers still shake. And that noise is exactly how we measure reality. When physicists say laser vibrations, they don't mean the light is wobbling in space. They mean the laser's frequency jitters because the hardware it's locked to moves by absurdly tiny amounts. Most ultra-stable lasers are locked to an optical cavity, basically two mirrors facing each other. If the cavity length changes even a little, the laser frequency shifts with it. And here's the brutal part. Even if you isolate everything, heat itself makes the mirrors and coatings jitter. The thermal noise can set a real floor on how stable the laser can get. How stable are we talking? Some systems have reported line widths below one hertz, even in the tens of millihertz class. That's like a note so pure it's almost a single line. But the world fights back. Seismic rumbles, acoustic bumps, tiny vibrations can imprint measurable frequency noise. That's why people build vibration insensitive cavity designs and serious isolation stacks. Then scientists look at the noise spectrum, how the jitter changes at different frequencies to separate what's heat, what's vibration, and what's just technical junk. And when you push that noise down, you don't just get a prettier laser, you get better optical clocks and sharper spectroscopy. Better stability means better measurement. So the paradox is real. The cleanest lasers are limited by tiny vibrations, and learning to read and tame that noise is how we measure the universe more precisely. Love mind-bending science. Subscribe for more.